What the hell is going on now, somebody? I was, uh... This is literally going on right now. Some She's saying some dude won't let her out. The people, rent people, is, is right there. I guess like I was talking about earlier, that guy who uh, was working on the thing. Like I said, this ain't the hood. This is... They didn't pay too much rent for this shit. Some, some supposedly, some nigga, hey, well, let me stop talking so y'all can hear what she's saying. She's screaming, he won't let her out, help, he won't let her out. And you notice she came on the balcony. Do you know this is where I make my videos? So he won't, I don't know what the hell this has to do with that, but I don't know, but I guarantee it's Genki Star Wars stuff. I don't think, I don't know, maybe, wait a minute, I said something earlier about them uh, videos about the women getting uh, jumped on by the Chinese people at the hair place at the nail place so whatever this is the gang stalkers the black women would rather do all this than stop gang stalking you know you can say this might be a real domestic violence situation I, I don't think so we'll see if the police pop up but that uh, that white girl right there at the bottom She's uh uh one of the rent people and that guy you see the door is open in that bottom apartment. Remember I was talking about him earlier in the other video? He's still out there. She was screaming and said he won't let her out or he was holding it. So I'm guessing see he was holding the door and uh look, look she comes out. Yeah, one of this. Yeah, she gets in that gold car. She's uh, now. Now that I came out, you know that she stopped screaming. But I was sitting in the house. And look, look, she came out just smoking cigarettes. I was sitting in the house, and all of a sudden I heard banging and screaming. And she supposedly is inside, but now all of the screaming is stopped. And look, you notice the uh, that girl right there, she looked up here at my apartment before she even, uh, you know, got out in, in the sidewalk. So, <laughs> Democrats, see what I'm saying? It's, you think I'm just talking shit, making this up? Uh, I'm some kind of sympathizer with white people or nothing. I'm telling you, this is the, 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 the New World Order shit. I don't know what these actors are, who these people are. Or, like I said, that guy I was talking about earlier, I guess he's a painter, maintenance guy, whatever. Right now, that guy right there, that that, that chick right there leaning on her car. And, and this woman. I don't see nothing going on no more. So, so a couple of minutes ago, to Kent I came right there, she was hollering, help, help. He won't let her out. Uh, now I'm recording. It's it's over with. Uh, I don't see her coming down the steps as she's so anxious to leave. And if she can't leave, what is he doing? Is he killing her right now? Is she in there? She in there getting murdered, you know. And I tell you, these people are ridiculous. You see what they do, the lengths they go through, rather than do right. They would rather do all of this, and this is not about oh, just lazy black folks or or anything. This is that gangs. Are, like I see, see the leaders. They try to take down the president, Pelosi, Adam Schiff. Instead of doing the right thing, they would rather do go through all these fucking antics. And please do not try to say, I don't know what I'm talking about. They, 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 because like I said, the tactics they use, the, the, the spying and the, and the aha and the stupidity.
Oh, he still won't let her out. If this is a real thing, ain't nobody finna go up there. And, and if he crazy, if he crazy enough to be whatever he doing, <laughs> shit, whatever y'all arguing about, ain't nobody. They said you gotta wait on the police. That's the only time I agree with the maintenance dude. Shit, I ain't scared, but I ain't finna go up there and, and get in between those. Dem- y'all could be like, uh, uh, Oh, y'all, says, y'all, that woman needs help. He said, we gave help. It's a, apparently the the little rent girl and the maintenance dude, remember I talked about him before. He just started working here about two months ago. Oh, well, no longer than that. He would uh, sometimes be at the store when I was at the store doing that gang stalking stuff. So, like I said, uh, you know, a lot of times he would be at the the trash can. What the hell is she throwing out? She looked like she ripped up some kind of paper. That uh that guy with the white hat, you know, black white and black coat on. You know, I guess she's trying to get them to come up there and let her out. I guess and she's saying he's on the outside. I guess he's blocking the door or holding the door. Uh, I, I'm a reporter, ghetto news, ghetto, <laughs> ghetto, ghetto news. But it ain't, it ain't, no, this ain't, that's what I'm saying. Now, this ain't a real situation. We've seen, I can't say we all, but we've seen real situations before. I just, and you can say it, it don't matter how, you know, it happens in every, and it does. You know, yeah, the motherfucking upscale, they, they be beating their women, too. We know that. Not two. Hell, mainly. They're the main ones. Cause they just get away with it because they got money. But what I'm saying, he won't let her out. He's holding the door. And... Yeah, so, police kind of slow. Remember that old song? Now one was a joke. Cause I know uh, something like this, and that's the uh, the uh, you know, little rent girl working one of the one of the. I guess that's a sexist name, rent girl. What is the proper name? Uh, uh, reception? Well, not a receptionist. So whatever, being the rent office. So, you know, she had to call the police. All this going on, and, and she talking about, can one of y'all come, see, come up here and, and do what? You know, whatever, he psychotic. Maybe he one of them other, if this is, you know, I know, I doubt it, but it could be he one of them motherfuckers that want to kill himself and her. He won't, she want to leave. He won't let her out. Shit, ain't nobody going up there to... Hey, you let her out. He might be ready to end it all. Whatever he thinks she did or she did do. Look, she, whatever it is, she don't even know the address. How many times you been been visiting this dude? I, I don't really know who, who the dude is. So she got a phone or she got some kind of phone. Y'all, see, like I said, don't, don't get on me talking about I should be helping instead of ain't nothing I can do. Shit, I don't, I am not fucking going over there. Hell, I was trying to get a little sleep before I go to work tonight in a couple of hours. Really, probably. What time is it? About f- four more hours, three more hours, really. So... I wouldn't know why this uh, crazy ass nigga won't just let her go. Said <laughs> somebody I know, nigga, <laughs> this shit would have never went down when somebody I know <laughs> let her ass go. Whatever you think she did, 
it ain't worth it to let her go. <laughs> yeah, she cheated on you. She cursed you out. She called you a name. Let her go, bro. Women too, you know. You trying to? I guess a woman can hold physically hold her her boyfriend in a house and stop him from leaving. But you know, if they want to go. Let them go. You could. I mean, I guess you could try to wait, wait, wait. Don't go, baby. You could try that shit. But if they adamant on leaving, let them fucking go. Is my advice. If you're doing all this and they want to leave, they probably ain't coming back no more. Hey? <laughs> or, and you know, that's the, that's the thing about it. it. Like I said, across all classes and races, she, they might, she might uh, be back over there. So he's opening. Oh, let me be quiet. She's saying he's holding, holding the door. Basically, he's on the outside. He has to be. Well, she she's a female, so he's putting all his. I mean, it, this nigga crazy. If he's holding her in his house, oh, maybe they live together. I don't know. Maybe she lived here too. I don't know what's going on. 